First of all, we got our uh, oil pump assembly over here. That doesn't look like an EJ22 oil pump assembly, Fox. Uh, hold on. I guess EJ25 oil pump assembly then is, isn't it? Well, so. wait, wait, wait a second. But but if it has EJ22 heads and it has an EJ25 block, well, what is this? This is a Franken motor. <laughs> yeah, boy. We're gonna put this together now. You should drink at least two beers for this operation because we could have put a beer can over this hose to prevent it from dripping on our camera. But while we're in here, uh, we want to remove this timing plug off the back of the bell housing. This little rubber guy right here. Ugh. Wait, we got a filler, don't we? No, we don't have an oil. <laughs> <laughs> well, everywhere on this car is like a place to set something. And I always set like certain tools in certain places in the car. Just from like being familiar with. But those don't require insanely huge amounts of He-Man torque. Oh man, I got shit like popping in my neck. Let me smear it on if you like. Um, set this aside. Let me show you what's up with the engine here. Oh. <laughs> man, you gotta look at me. All right, can we get on with this now? Clip it right there. Three out of last. I got it. All right. Oh, that does give some pretty good tension, eh? Oh, yeah. Here, quit being lazy. Which one's let this one out? Oh, that one didn't go yeah. out? You didn't let it out. Well, well I didn't. <laughs> it's like a like smoky, like a saloon. Like... What's up, folks? Oh, welcome to Wisconsin. All right, goofy dog bone tool. Let's see if you're worth the $10 I bought from the crackhead at the tire store. Oh. Uh, yeah. All right, I'm going to pull the pin. Ooh. That, make sure you hit the thing in squarely. Cause if you screw this up, you're starting over again. Our intake, it got moist down because uh, this garage we're working in, it's kinda, well, it was raining and it was leaking there, leaking here, leaking there. Yeah, for sure, definitely gonna have to wipe the excess. The problem I know I'm at the face is tightening it because all that oil is gonna be like, oh, we're gonna make All it needs to be as hand tight as a quarter turn. Yeah, I know, but now we gotta tighten it pretty good. I explained to the folks with the C-clamp. So put your C-clamp on the bottom, tighten it down, and then use the tool of genius, wag it with a hammer. Oh yeah. Oh, look how shiny that one is. See this one? See how it's shiny? See the piston's shiny? Yeah. The other ones are all black and shit. Look at that. See how that's shiny on the edges? This one may have had a, a failing head gasket. And we don't like wasting our time with Subarus. Not that Subarus are wasting our time, but time with Subarus is not to be wasted. Yeah, don't fuck with me. Don't fuck with Subaru Lions. Don't try to steal my battery out from my 94 Legacy. Those things have happened around here. Oh, why the hell is this so hard to turn? But this is what you want to know how to do, is to be able to turn a bolt like this. If you can do that, you're in good shape. There you go. Tight is good. She's yummy. How do you feel about that? You installed the Subaru engine. Not yet. Team here. Let's put a little spook of it there. Just enough. That's all it takes. It's my birthday today. And this is what we get to do for my birthday. We got the gasket on it that's just hanging out because the cool gasket like it is. We're gonna lift this side up. Do the same thing. We can actually push that up even more just because we're strong. Because we get our vitamins and stuff. Oh yeah, sexual frustrations and Subarus. Lube it up good. Don't be afraid. 
Well, well, we want to get into the proverbial pants of the Subaru's timing belt here. Nice and easy. You know what you feel? You'll feel it when it like tops up. It's like when you get your dick all the way into the. You know the ain't going anymore. Can you get a good shot of my tea bag on here? Yeah, we got a good tea bag. See my tea bag. Yeah, there we go. Alright, then we can remove the engine crane. Now we're ready to rock and roll with the rest of this engine. That's it. I mean, for right now, though, Fox, like, it's, this is it. All right, well, who started? But we got, we got, we got both look at the camera. This is it, folks. This is starting the Franken motor. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Boy, look at this car. Right you ready for this? This is the uh, cycle the key off now a few times to get some fuel pressure built up. Turn the headlights off. Cycle the key off and on.
get sideways on this turn don't, so don't easy. Don't do it. Don't do it. Traffic would let me. Don't. Not, you just jab not, the brake, not, the wheel. I know, but not in the not in the first test. So you tell test me drive. like like you're freaking out, like I'm stopping, and you're acting like I'm still gonna go sideways. It's the test. You know, I'm, you know, it's, it's you know, it's. The, I'm trying to be easy on it for you. No, I know. I appreciate that. 